watching The Reality Show. Today we have a very special guest. Everybody welcome the very talented, the very hilarious Buck Wild. Oh, thank you so much. So first I want to start by asking you, how did you come up with your name? Uh, Buck Wild came about probably 1989. I used to dance. Mm -hmm. I was a dancer. I used to dance for like Tough Crew. And back in the day, like a lot of like two brown, little coin names. And I had a, a, a jacket on. Nice uh, uh, little background dancer. Were you like a b-boy? Uh, yeah, I was, I was, I was trash. I was <laughs> trash. I am very curious to know what type of student you were at school. I mean, as funny and as crazy as you are. Crazy. <laughs> Did you they get They kicked me out. Yeah, they kicked me out of school. I got kicked out of Masterment. Really? Yes. I got kicked out of Masterment for behavior modification. That's good. So I'm you from North Philly. <laughs> Smart, pain in the butt, push the teacher's buttons. You know, I had behavior problems, meaning uh, I acted out. Like, I think school didn't challenge me at all. Mm -hmm. I was smarter than the teachers, and I, ch and I challenged and I questioned everything. So everybody knows you as Buck Wild, the actor and comedian, of course. Mm -hmm. But there's another role that you play. Tell everybody about LB. Who's LB? Oh, LB is this little wretched Muppet <laughs> that a friend of mine named Delmont uh, came up with. He came up with this app called Urban Cloud. And if you go to urbancloud.com, you can like download the app and you can watch every episode of LB. And uh, LB is about a little Muppet that nobody talks to him like he's a Muppet. Mm -hmm. He's rich. They don't know how he became rich. <laughs> he's not from Philly, but he dates all the bad girls from Philly. Mm -hmm. He never walks, but he always in somebody Louis Vuitton or Gucci bag. <laughs> like this little... <laughs> Um, your promo video, mm -hmm. I watched a recent promo video of yours, and you said that the reason why, and I'm quoting you, mm -hmm. you said, the reason why I'm not on a lot of stuff is because people are afraid of me. Why are people afraid of you? I think people are just afraid of the rawness of me. Uh, just Buck Wild, just the name itself yeah. scares people. Buck Wild, oh, what is he going to say? It's just me being me. Mm -hmm. Like, I, I do comedy. Comedy is not my life, but it's a platform that I display my talent on and I just share my stories with it. And some people just scared of the reality of somebody real coming and sitting down and giving a real interview and just being themselves. Well, are you ever afraid to disappoint your crowd as buckwild as you are? I'll dis I'll di I will discipline disappoint my crowd by not being myself. That's true. What advice do you have for everybody that's watching uh, the reality show who have dreams that they, you know, wish to accomplish one day? Well, if you're watching the reality show, you're a part of reality because yeah. this is what happens. Anytime I come home and I'm in Phil, this is what I watch. So I want to know who's the next up and coming superstar, what stars coming through, showing love, giving back. I think if you're watching the show right now and you're trying to be a comedian, because that's the only thing I can speak okay. for right now, yeah. is a comic or an actor or a radio host or whatever. I just say go hard at what you what you what you believe in and get the right team behind you because you only as big as big big as your My team. My last question is who is Buck Wild? Buck Wild is a guy in here sweating because y'all turned the air off. <laughs> um, Buck Wild is Aziz White. Buck Wild is me. Buck Wild is a, a comedic actor, radio host father, uncle, your next door neighbor, a dude that would have robbed you 20 years ago but got his life straight. It's not, but why is this just me, man? I'm me. I just want people to allow me to be me and express myself. And I and I appreciate you taking the chance, getting me in here interviewing me and uh, let me, you know, express myself the way I want to express myself and do me. That's just it. <laughs> so every guest that comes to my show plays a game. Mm -hmm. Today I want to play a game called Spit it out. Spit it out. Yes. Spit. That sounds like some girl on. Oh, y'all know how that's a long story. Oh, story. man. That's a long story. <laughs> Vegas. 87. Not that game. We're not going to play that game. Whatever happened to Vegas State in Vegas? Tamika Jackson, 21.6 Earth Street. Nothing yet. <laughs> <laughs> <No>. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> I can't touch you? Oh, why? I'm tingling? Oh, man. Okay, no, no tingling. No tingling. No, oh, that's not funny. I am so not funny. I can't be funny. Did, were you just saying my breast falls? Okay. So, what happens if I do this? Such a good. Put all that in here. Hold that. First of all, make me get this one. I'm gonna lift it. Makeup is now the floor is messy. Once everything. you pull that mojo out, it's over. Yeah, it ain't a woman, it ain't a woman on earth. <laughs> it turned down the mojo. Well, tell everybody how they can contact you. Comedian Buck Wild, Google me. That's it. Just Google me. Facebook Buck Wild, Instagram Buck Wild 215, or just Google the popularity group. I done been around the world, like I done kissed a lot of girls, so I'm guessing that it's true. Uh, make me holler and I bet a million dollars. Don't nobody kiss it like you.